Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new match review on my channel. Today I'm going to be talking about the Arsenal vs Arsenal Villa match, which Arsenal, they played really freaking good today at You're the Emirates. And also Arsenal are at 5th place today, uh, just behind Southampton after the match with 42 points. Both, both Southampton has a game in hand though, uh, but I have a bit better goal difference since Southampton has only you know, conceded 16 goals and Arsenal has conceded 25 goals though. Um, <coughs> so, uh, and also guys, if you guys want to see the highlights, just hang around for the video and just wait, uh, you know, to the, towards the end of the video, then then we are going to go ahead and take a look at those. Uh, but still, David Espina, he, he continued in goals since Chesney hasn't really been that good. Kieran Gibbs also on the bench, didn't get to play today, uh, where Nacho Monreal, he has been pretty good for them recently. And also Hector Bellerin, since Debussy is out with his uh, shoulder, which is... Uh, and also Francis Coquelin, he started off on the middle today. He's been actually really good for Arsenal. Stanley Cosola managed to bag himself a goal in seven, in the 74 minute after a penalty where he's it's just so easy for Stanley Cosola. And also Tia Walker is back. He's actually in really, really good shape now because he scored against Brighton, I do believe it was, and also against Arsenal Miller today. So he's uh, definitely picking up himself a bit of form after being out for like six months, I do believe it is. And also Olivier Gier. Olivier Giroud was actually really good today. Managed to score a goal. Kind of an easy one just to run past the defense of Osseville, which isn't really the best to say the least. And also Messi to also managed to score himself a goal. So a really good match by Arsenal, winning four with four goals. Great for the goal difference and also great for the points because they are pretty close to a fourth place. Liverpool also has been in really good shape lately. The same with Tottenham, not really in the cup. But in Premier League, that has actually been pretty decent. So we need to wait. Ooh. So we need to wait until the Southampton Swansea match today to see if Arsenal is going to go in front of Southampton or not. But anyway, guys, thank you guys very much for watching. And I will see you.